if you want to beat the winter blues, I have to say there's no better way than taking a walk or a stroll through the vineyard. You get a little bit of exercise and hey, maybe even try a little bit of wine along the way. We're joined alongside Steve Johnson here. He's one of the co-owners of Parallel 44. Steve, thanks so much for having us out this morning. Thank you, Colin. So tell us a little bit about this idea that you guys had. It's vineyard walks. It's kind of just as the name implies, right? Yeah, we're combining uh, educational aspects and fun aspects at the same time because you're actually sampling out in the vineyard with little cups, safely distanced. I mean, you're standing among the vines and so you're learning about, you know, what makes these products unique. You know, it's not just a bottle of wine, there's a story behind it. So it's a great way to educate and have fun at the same time. And speaking of a little education, we've got some maps here on the wall. Tell, yeah. us, tell us a little bit about this. Yeah, this is a little educational corner here that people are pretty fascinated by because you don't really think Wisconsin is wine country, but it is the beginning of something that has a really world-class potential. Uh, terroir, that's a, the French word for sense of place, and we really emphasize that here and on the tour that you're actually tasting wine, and the way it tastes is based on the soils that we have, the climate that we have, and the topography that, that we have. So you're experiencing that firsthand. Uh, one thing people are really surprised about is what's called an American viticultural area or Appalachian. So I'm sure many people have heard of Napa Valley, Sonoma Valley, Bordeaux. Mm. Those are fairly designated regions when the government is convinced that you have something distinctive about your soil, climate, and topography that lends itself to distinctive wine. So here, basically, the thumb of Wisconsin, we're in the heart of it, is referred to as the Wisconsin Ledge. That's the official Appalachian. It's one of the newest Appalachians in the United States. And if you see that on the back of the label, the Wisconsin Ledge, you know that 85% of the content of the bottle was grown in that region. And that's a sign of quality that a lot of people look for in wine. That is fascinating stuff. Stuff you, you never thought you would yeah. learn about just wine in general. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I, I tell people, like, if I had told them 20 years ago that you'd be staying in one of the newest wine appellations of the country, I'd be laughed off the property. But here we are. Excellent stuff. Well, Steve, hey, thank you again so much for joining us. Thank you. So Parallel 44, their vineyards or vineyard walks with the winemaker taking place Saturdays. You can find more information by simply heading over to their Facebook page and looking them up there. Thank you, Calvin. That looks like so much fun. You get mm -hmm. a nice bottle of wine and you get to walk through the vineyards.